On July 17, the process to continue the selection of nominees for the position of GCOM chair continued with a high-level meeting between the president's representatives and those of the opposition leader. The president's team was Minister Vola Lawrence and myself, and the leader of the opposition team was um, Mr. Irfan Ali and Mr. Anil Nandlal. At the meeting, the leader of the opposition team presented four additional names to be considered and indicated to us that the two names that were submitted by the president did not find favor with the leader of the opposition. We agreed that the list of names that had now been submitted, the further list, will be considered by His Excellency the President and any further directions on the matter will be given by His Excellency the President. According to the Director General of the Ministry of the Presidency, Joseph Harmon, the process will continue on July 18. The President's understanding of the ruling of the Caribbean Court of Justice is that in the hammering out process that he will make submissions and that he expects that the submissions will receive consideration by the leader of the opposition in a list that is consensual that will come to him. So I, I cannot say exactly whether the president will submit no, more names, but that is clearly uh, something which might very well be. From the Ministry of the Presidency with videographer Kenny Ann Bacchus, Paul McAdam for InfoHub.